Hello everyone, this is Imran here and today we are going to talk about what is Bardeen and uh, what Bardeen does for their customers and what is automation actually like this is an automation website so yeah so as you can see over here make your apps work for you so obviously what automation does that uh, if we click on one thing it will do the whole process uh, like AI will be doing this that for you and uh, you don't need to do every single step so first of all what is Bardeen? Bardeen saves you time by automating repetitive tasks with a shortcut. As you can see over here, it combines a powerful workflow builder. Workflow is like a, it's like an automation which you are going to make and pre-built automation which I will show you. And uh, AI based recommendation and contextual automation. So what is automation actually? So automation is a term of technology application where human input is minimized. Uh, this includes business process automation, uh, IT automation, personal applications such as home automation and more. So they are very simple once you are able to understand what they like what are they doing so before we go further let's scroll down and you can see this is an interface which you will be seeing in future for the Bardeen. this is the interface you can see Bardeen works where you do like uh, if you are working on zoom or google calendar so you can also access from there uh you can see ai helps you find the right automation for the right context these are some examples for the automation uh, catalog like you can see it's from pipe drive so you can just click on it and it will add activity to your pipe drive reel you don't need to like go ahead and adding every single step by yourself it will do uh, for you so yeah it's like a shortcut for iphone so if you click on one thing it will do the whole process for you it's like an automation so and in shortcut apps you can also see there's an option for automation in iphone app so it's, it's just like that uh, you can also explore it from here if you want run your own uh, workflow automation you can see build your own in no time and without codes so without coding you can do that so these are just if you want to explore it more you can go ahead what I'm going to do that I'm going to create an account and I'm gonna meet you at how you can create your account and uh, how you can add that to your extension because it's, it's an extension it's not a website it's an extension so let's go ahead and do that so we are going to click on so we are going to click on it's free like try it, it's free and you will end up over here you can see Bardeen automate workflows with one click just click on add to chrome and it will start adding to your extensions once it's done you can see it has been done and it will open a new page where you can sign in with your Bardeen so if you don't have an account you can create an account from over here and you can sign in with Google also so what I'm going to do I'm going to create an account create account and it's far and it's done as you can see over here we are at the interface of Bardeen so now you will end up over here as you can see there are some few steps which you have to do before going further so as you can see it's saying that uh, pin extension it may be hiding behind this so this is like as you can see on the top left uh, right corner you can see extension option if you click on it Bardeen is over here just click on it it will be pinned over the top so next thing is tell us about your job if you want to tell them you can go ahead and tell them i'm just gonna click on content creator next uh launch Bardeen with alt b is the short shortcut like if you are at zoom call and uh, zoom application or somewhere you can just click on alt b you don't even need to go over here if you want so yeah this is just chilling if you, if you click on like uh, alt b right now this is what we have so let's talk about it what do we have right here so this this is all you can see it's an automation pre-made automation that they have already provided to us you can see all apps and if you go and scroll down you can see there are multiple apps also over here and you can also create it which we will talk about it this is the playbook and this is the explorer so if we scroll you can see there are no scroll like a wheel over here but still you can scroll and you can see that uh, create notion page if you want to do that just click on it it will create it uh, create utm campaign link uh, copy get send like send an email invitation to bard from to bardin uh, send an email to the github user from the current page like if you are at uh, google calendar and open your extension like from rb or from here from here on the top right corner and just click on it that's it you don't even need to go at uh, github or like email your gmail account so you, you can just do that just click on rb and click on this that's it and if you scroll down more you can see there are multiple things over here which you can do and uh, this is all pre-made and if you go at the top left corner 
here right besides uh, playbooks you can see auto books so this is all the same but they are more of it and uh, you can just go ahead and scroll them down you can see that this is scrapper you can create it and you can also create like from the template if you want so and uh, you can see that on the right corner you can see grid view you can go ahead and go with the like list view if you want which will be very useful i guess you can click on data sourcing and research it will show you accordingly and uh, that's it if this is all the pre-made yes so let's just suppose you want to create new like it's not even available over here just click on create auto book and you will end up over here so on the top left corner you can see all apps you can add integrated apps if you click on it you will find multiple applications over here like facebook uh, sorry twitter whatsapp trello uh, slack pipe drive notion google sheet there are multiple over here jira is also here uh, sms notification you can send notification with just one click just pre-made them and you just, you just need to make an automation regarding it and you just need to click in future just one time and it will create everything for you uh you can see google docs over here also uh, dropbox and everything and if you go all i guess it's all yeah so this is all the application integrated application that they are providing to you so let's just say like uh, you can set the triggers with scheduling and once something happens so let's just suppose if we click on this you can see when i right click on a website like uh, for this tutorial base i'm just going to explain it like uh, if we are going to click on twitter so this should happen right away like if i click on twitter and uh, it will create an automation for a message to my friend or my employee through dm like twitter dm so this is you can do like right away you can inform them like uh, i'm on twitter so this just for this tutorial base i'm just going to explain that so yeah so you can also visit a specific web page with one click so this is all good like just say when i right click on a website click on it so this is all we have over here like yes what happens now click on add add command new action what action you want to create like what you want so you can also browse playbooks like the one we have already seen uh, pre-made and uh, you can also add them here so if you click on more you can see there are multiple actions which you can add here like if i click on a website what happens you can see over here like uh, you can upload it like what do you want to upload you can add them so this is all you need to know about bardeen as you can see you just need to create everything accordingly like uh, you can set condition if you want you can add action and if accidentally you click on the background you don't need to like panic it will get lost just click on rb again and it will come back you can go ahead and uh, zoom out more so you can see uh, properly what is going on you can click on it you can set the like uh, condition accordingly and you can also delete it from here and uh, after that you can see on the top right corner go into settings you can see you can set the automation name if you want and advanced options like uh, add description pick a category etc you can do that save progress and done so, and you can also go ahead and open the full screen if you want so this is very clean so yeah that's it this is all you need to know about like bardeen how you can create your automation and uh, all automations which you are going to make it's accordingly your like your preferences so yeah i'm just going to discard it for now and there are multiple things over here which you can also go ahead and explore it to yourself maybe something will come up with your requirement so and as you can see over here you can see more options click on it show details it will show every single thing like what is going to happen so, and if you see over here like what this automation does this automate auto book opens your next google calendar meeting link and open a notion page for notes when the meeting is starting in one minute so this is this will be happening like in just few seconds as you just need to click on this uh automation and it will create, create it for you so this is very easy way to do that i hope you understand what i've tried to say come here explore it to yourself you will understand every single thing without uh, applying it and experimenting on it by yourself i don't think you can achieve anything so come here listen to this video carefully and start working on it this is a very very like a clean and uh, efficient automation website so yeah thank you for watching this video leave a like and subscribe bye bye